Okay, the next part of our work is domain redirection. This is oftentimes done when we own a domain, but perhaps we need to redirect where it goes to depending on new content. A lot of times people will buy a domain and a web hosting space together, and so therefore it's all managed in one panel. However, we're doing kind of a budget-friendly approach in which we have purchased a domain from Google and we are also going to point it to a Google site. Now, you can do this again with any domain host. You don't need to go with Google. You could go with any of the big guys. That's fine. And likewise, when you repoint your content, you don't need to repoint it to a Google site. You can repoint it to any website that you have going. But what makes this easy and nice is that you own the domain name and you don't have to stick with one platform. If you wanted to redirect your entire content to a new location, domain redirection is the way to go. So once again, you're going to take your purchase domain.com, and this is obviously just a sample, and you're going to repoint it to any of your sites. And final time, while I'm using the Google product line in both of these, you are not required to. So a sample that I'm going to show you right now is I have a domain that I own, evehorner.me, and it currently points to ehorner.net, which means that all of my content sits on a server that's tied to a, a domain name called ehorner.net. When I'm done, what I want to do is I want to repoint evehorner.me over to a sample Google site over here. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to pause the video while I do a little bit more setup and I'll be right back. Okay, and now I am back and I have logged in to my Google domains management area and I can see that I actually own a couple of different domains here. Now, this is the one I'm going to be uh, using as my sample here. So if I click on website, you can see that I am already forwarding evehorner.me to ehorner.net. Now I can show that to you. If I come up here, let me just show you in this tab, it is ehorner.net. That is my primary location for all of my content. However, if I come to a new tab and I type in ehorner.me, this is the redirect. So I've got another domain and I'm pointing it to ehorner.net. So watch what happens. As soon as I type that in, it automatically pops over to ehorner.net. So I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to stop this particular forwarding and then I will show you how to forward to another domain. Okay, and we are back and let me go ahead and pull this in. This is my sample Google site here. And what I want to do is when I type in or when a person types in evehorner.me, I want it to automatically redirect to this particular sample site over here. And of course, these are all samples, but I could be redirecting to anything I want to redirect to. So how to make how do I make that happen? I'm going to actually prepare because I know I'm going to highlight and copy that because that information I will need once I get back into the redirection space. Now I'm back into a uh, different tab and I'm looking at my domains.google.com and I've got my domains loaded here and I'm going to click on the domain that I want to repoint. Pardon me for one moment. I want to go back on that. There's an easier way to do this. Over here where it says website, I'm going to click on the plus. Now I could simply build out a website over here if I wanted to, and it gives me some options to go to different uh, commercial website uh, hosts. But notice down here at the bottom, I've got this option to forward, and it's saying forward ephorner.me to a website. So I'm gonna click on forward. It's going to ask me, well, where do I want to re-forward that to? I'm going to paste that into 
and remember where I got this. This is where I want to end up. So I copied and pasted that. I'm going to go ahead and click on forward. Successfully changed uh, domain uh, settings. Now, doesn't always update immediately. And so don't get freaked out if it doesn't happen right away. But in theory, if I type in evehorner.me and hit enter, boom, there it goes. It goes directly to the new portfolio sample that I'm setting up. So that's how easy it is to redirect your domain. I'm going to stop this video now and we will pick up with other domain topics at a later point. Thanks for watching. Bye.